Well, are you trying to buy a condo or a home in Metro Louisville? You better be ready to pounce with a quick payment and you may end up paying a lot more than the posted price. Bidding wars over homes that are on the market for just a few hours are being uh, reported to be common across Kentuckiana. Dennis Tang is talking with a local realtor about what, what people can expect these days when looking for a new house. We were already in what was considered a seller's market before the pandemic, but the needle has been pushed a lot further in that direction over the last few months. Right now in Jefferson County, for single family resident homes, at this very moment, there's 513 listings. Realtor Sarah Weber says it's unusual to see so many buyers and so few homes for sale. What we're experiencing is inventory at record lows and interest rate also at record lows. She says the market is seeing a huge increase in buyers, partly driven by the low interest rates set to support the economic recovery from the pandemic, leading many to become first time home buyers. Of millennials being able to afford their first home, and also people moving to Louisville and Kentucky. She says the shortage in houses for sale partly stems from the shortages in labor and construction materials brought on by the pandemic. Lumber prices have been going up. Um, window packages have been going up, plumbing fixtures have been going up. All this means it's a great time to sell, with sellers often finding their homes on the market for just days before it's put under contract, with buyers willing to offer more money and to waive inspections, and often lining up to see homes for sale, something she experienced just recently with a client. When we had got there, there was a set of buyers in the house during their scheduled time, and then when we were leaving, there was another set of buyers waiting for us to leave to go in for their house tour. Weber says buyers should be prepared going in, knowing how much they're pre-approved to spend and what they can realistically afford. I'm just telling all of my buyers right now, be prepared to offer at least five to $10,000 over listing price. Above all, she says buyers need to be patient and trust it'll all work out. In Louisville, Dennis Ting, WHAS 11 News.